I'm not just saying this, the best fitting bras I have worn in years, 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 years. Hey guys, it's Lisa. Happy Friday. You're going to feel my excitement in this video. Plus, I was telling John, this is the joys of working from home. We have, okay, not only are we getting our gutters cleaned and we're getting our whole house pressure washed and he is here. And you know what? He has a YouTube channel. He was just telling me, so I'll put that down below. He does videos on pressure washing. I thought that was so cool. And we have them building a house across the street so you may hear lots of background sounds but we're going to go on with it and I am just so excited about so many things I have to show you today so first we're going to get started with a new bra line that I have learned about in the past couple of weeks and the brand is Comfeely They've asked me to partner with them to show you their bras and their leggings that I have on right now. And as soon as I looked at the website, I was like, okay, this is something we are going to like. So I ordered three bras and the leggings that I'm going to show you now. And they are actually having a Black Friday sale that is up to 50% off. And as of this morning, when I looked on the website, these leggings were like $9.99. So let me tell you a little bit about the brand. Comfeely is a brand born out of deep desire to support women's health, comfort, and confidence. At Comfeely, our mission goes beyond simply creating products. We are committed to providing wire-free, seamless bras that prioritize women's well-being, allowing them to feel their best every day. Designed with breast-friendly features, this bra ensures maximum comfort and gentle support, catering to natural contours and providing pressure-free, seamless fit for all-day wear. These bras are made with 43% spandex, far exceeding the 15% industry standard, offering exceptional elasticity, shape recovery, and comfort. This is the secret to the ultra comfy experience. All fabrics are certified safe for long-term wear, free from harmful substances, and gentle on the skin, meeting the rigorous standards used in baby clothing. I am going to be putting footage in here while I talk about these bras. So the first one I have on, and it is the, I'm going to go ahead and just show you, it's the black scalloped one, and it's lace. I wore this shirt, it's one of the Pumi tops on purpose, to show you how smooth this bra is. And the beauty of it, so here is the scalloped edge, and look how there's no like skin busting out back here or around the back. I love how the back is wide because then it keeps us from having that extra skin or fat or any of those bulges go over there. I've never gotten a bra that comes with this, the extender. This is important because like I am small around the rib cage. So a lot of times if I get a bra that is small enough around, the cups are too far apart. So this allows for maximum adjustment because I can wear it like this and it fits perfectly. Honestly, I'm not just saying this, the best fitting bras I have worn in years, 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 years. And so if you are like in between sizes, then you'll have this too. Or it's just, I don't know, I feel overwhelmed with, um, good feelings. Okay, let me go on and show you the, oh, I thought of something else too. This is the first one I looked at and you can see why. Like it is just me all together. Okay, here is the information. Okay, first, no tags. No tags. No tags to cut off or to deal with. Another thing that I wanted to tell you about, typically the first thing that I do is take out the pads. But today, since I was trying these on for you guys, I wanted to keep these in. I'm gonna keep them in. It does not add that pad bulge and it gives me no extra cleavage. I don't want cleavage. My cleavage days are gone. I think that's a look, kind of like really big lip injections. You know, there was a time when I didn't care if I looked like that, but now that's why I don't get them. I don't want to look like that anymore. There was a time when I wanted cleavage. It's not now. So I love that this gives me so much support. 
uh, lifts. Of course, no underwire in any of these. And like they said, it's got more spandex in it so that it bounces back. Okay, so let's read what it says here. 58% nylon, 41% spandex, hand wash with light colors, do not bleach, da, 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 all that stuff. So here is the back. It was not hard to snap on. Gonna keep the pads in. Super excited about that because then it'll keep, you know, everything looking better. And I love this color. I think this color is beautiful. Okay, I'm gonna try not to go on and on, but I'm gonna tell you, 99%, 99% sure you're gonna love these. And with the sale going on, I don't have a code for you because they have this big promotion, the Black Friday promotion going on, but they said maybe when it's over, um, hopefully I'll get to work with them again, but if it's over, they said they might get, give me a code to put down below so you can always check back here or always you can always ask comment or dm me okay this one i thought was super cool because i have been wanting a brown bra and look at this with the brown straps how pretty is that i love this so all of these are kind of like a mix of comfort and pretty you know what I mean? Pretty. We want to like what we're putting on. And this kind of reminds me too, I've always loved these colors together, like Neapolitan ice cream, Van Chalk Straw. And so, yeah, just love them. What else can I tell you that is so good? So none of that like hard stuff on the side, but it does have like that extra, extra support right there. You can see it. This one's like really pretty. The lace one is really pretty. Like you could wear it underneath something. I'm just super excited. And that is probably one of my most asked questions is about bras. I would say bras. Um, I get a lot of carnivore questions, uh, skincare questions, but a bra is the main one that I get. So thank you to Comfeely for asking me to partner with them. Wonderful. Just two thumbs up. Okay, let me show you the leggings because the leggings are um, very different. Not very different, but very, very supportive. I am used to wearing ones that have like not a lot of support and I can really tell the difference. Okay, it has tummy control. So this whole band is tummy control, but yet I'm not squishing. They're not miserable. They're just solid control and pretty. I just got my Uggs on that I just showed you guys because it's cold in here because we've been opening the door a lot talking to the pressure washing guy. So leggings, I believe it says um, tummy control and booty lift, but I'll be honest with you guys. Um, if you watch my carnivore video, I've lost weight and just, I do not naturally have a booty, never have. So I've gone back to my natural state. <laughs> <laughs> which I am fine with. So, okay, while I'm standing up, let's show you some shoes that I got this week. So thank you to Comfeely. I, I love their stuff. Okay, look at these. Very similar to the Dolce Vitas that I got, but these don't have the squared off toe. These are from Ann Taylor. I saw them on the website and I ordered them. And I think they're very, very chic. They're, if my typical Uggs or the Steve Maddens are just not your style, this is for you. Very chic. Oh, they feel good. Okay, these are good. going to be good. I can tell right now. These are like good slippers. These are, I don't go around the house barefooted. And I don't put my socks on until I go to bed. So, love these. They're so pretty. So pretty. Okay, then I got my custom Converse in. I'll be honest, I did not make a lot of changes. You can pick every single thing, guys. You can pick everything. Like you can change the stripe, you can change the shoelaces, you can change this rubber, you can change this stripe, you can do whatever you want. The main, oh, I did change this to black because I thought th these were super cool. But the main thing I got is the extra cushioning. So let me put these on real quick and I'll show you. Okay, here they go. And they do feel like extra 
kind of extra cushiony. I got these a little bit roomy so that I could wear socks with these. I wanted to wear my Bombas socks. My, my thoughts were I wanted to have these when I'm traveling if I want to wear them, you know, in the airport and everything. And I've had such bad experience lately with my, it's not that my shoes were too small, but I just wanted plenty of room in the toes. And thinking about traveling in the winter time, I wanted to be able to wear thick socks. I got plenty of shoes I can wear with no socks, but I think they're cool. Okay, and then I really should wait to show you these until I do my quince video. I can't, that's how excited I am about them. I love these. I did order another pair of boots that I didn't like as much and they didn't fit me well. So I'll save those for you because you might like them and they might fit your foot well. I am discovering I am like my dad and I don't want to show my feet because people are weird about feet. They either are, are obsessed with them or repulsed by them. So right where my foot comes up to my ankle is high. And that's why a lot of shoes rub across the top of my foot. Well, these beauties, you guys, the cowboy boots of your dreams right here. They are just, they're perfection, perfection. I mean, they're real leather. I mean, it's a real, it's not a rubbery sole. If you want something that's much cheaper and I still really like those Steve by Steve Madden's from Walmart, I really like those. But these are, I mean, can I say the best I've ever gotten? I have gotten Lucases, Tacovas, Zara, all the different ones. I I've gotten so many pairs of cowboy boots. Fry, okay, I would say they're out there with fries. Let me put them on for you. They, okay, they don't have a zipper. You just slip your foot in. I don't have any socks on, but the other day I just wore them with a trouser sock. Look at how good they are. They're just cowboy boot enough to give you the style, but they're not like, you know what I mean? Like, I feel like even the most conservative person would love these. These are lifetime cowboy boots. I am so stoked about these. And, okay, do you have a bigger calf? Because these do have more room around the calf. So that would help you if you do. And even if you don't, I love, I think the room around the calf is vibey. I love it. I love that space. I love how they go down. Oh, I'm scared they're going to be sold out because they're so good. Let me, sh let me show you the front too. Pointed not too pointed, don't like go way up in the front, perfect heel. I mean, I wore these over to my parents. They loved them too. And they are, they believe me, they are experts on the whole cowboy boot thing. My mom has several pair. I mean, beautiful. Look at the stitching. I'm gonna tell you, Quince has been very, very impressive. I feel like how I can help you is by sizing because that is something I've had to, I think I what shoes am I going to wear today? I get my roots done, my gray roots done at three today. Okay, so let me just calm down, calm down and get on to the next thing. Okay, this is something else that got me hyped up this morning. Yesterday, I went to Sephora and I've got a fragrance collaboration with them in December. So I wanted to go out there and see what was new. And I have known the girls out at Sephora since ours opened. So it's easy for me to talk to them and say, what are fragrances that people come back over and over again for, for refills? What is the latest and greatest? What is for the person who wants this, that, and the other? So look forward to that video coming up. And then I wanted to just see what was new because I haven't been anywhere lately. And one of the things was this, the Huda Easy Blur. You guys, it does not happen very often that I put on a foundation and I love it immediately. It's what I have on today. I got two different colors. I'll be honest, we matched it to the Lancome Tint Idol. 355N because I've been wearing that this week and really loving it. It's another really good one. So the colors we chose were Jalichi, which is 320G. So this is more of your peachy golden. And then this is the one, okay, this is the one that I've got on. And then this is Latte, which is 300N. Now, if I were going to not use concealer, 
This would probably be slightly too, not too dark, but wouldn't give me enough sculpted look. Like I like the contrast in my makeup. I don't want to look all one color. So if I didn't want to use concealer, which my favorite ever is the Natasha Denona High Glam in N6. I just ordered a backup. Then I would probably like this one, which is Latte, and then I would go in with more darker face powders, things like that to build it up. So you can, you can either contour or reverse contour, but you guys, I know I'm late to the game, but I didn't want to order this online because I couldn't figure out what my shade was, but wow, wow. It just, I mean, I think my exact words were, wow, 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 <laughs> when I tried this on because I just couldn't believe it. In the squeezy tube, used it with my same, you know, beauty blender, or it's actually the pawpaw sponges is what I use, but I'm just super excited about that. Something else I tried new today is the House Labs eyeliner pen. I actually asked her what the best-selling liquid eyeliner was, and she said this one and the one size. Well, she, I forgot that most people do consider this liquid liner. I was talking about literally liquid liner, because you probably noticed in, it was one of my videos I just did in my bedroom. You can see I need to go over my band with liquid or black liner because the glue starts showing, some of the eyeshadow gets on it and you can see it. Well, so she said that the best one is Makeup Forever. And I was like, yeah, I just, I thought I'll just pick up the Maybelline because I know I like the Maybelline. So I ended up getting this because I haven't ever tried it and so far so good. So if you like my liner today, that's what I have on. I think it will be even better after I store it like this. So far, if I had to say though, benefit roller liner, it's hard to beat. It just really is hard to beat, but I didn't mind trying that. And then this I saw and I thought we would put this on today because I can see that my lip that I love, I brought it out here to show you again. This is the Chanel Longwear Mary Rose. It's the best. But I'm trying out so many different lip liners for my own lip liner launch that I'm doing. Today, I tried one that I'm not as crazy about. And I can tell it's too gray for this because see, this is already kind of cool tone. So what we're going to do is try this on over it. This is called Faux Filler Shimmer Lip Gloss. And I haven't tried it yet. I just got it yesterday. But it looks right up our alley. And let's swatch it. Ugh. Okay. Oh. So there is the swatch. Okay. Let's put some on. Ooh, that is pretty. So I'm going to carry it over the lip liner. There it is. Sweet. Kind of like vanilla. Yeah, like candy. So no regrets on that. I like the wand too. Thick. What am I trying to... Definitely. This is a good one. If you're someone who, like I used to be, I used to never wear lip liner, lipstick, and lip gloss. I was pretty much a lip liner, lip gloss kind of girl. But I always had ones like this that had plenty of pigment. So that would be good for you. Okay. And then you guys, this palette, I would say I only really love about one out of five NARS palettes that ever comes out. They're eyeshadow palettes, whatever. This I love. I have it on today. No blush. This is just this color and this color combined. And it gives me that look. I just love it, love it, love it. Something else that I showed you last week that is so good, so good. Couldn't, Chanel, Dior, nothing could be better than these. This brush that comes with it, the e.l.f. brush, Liquid Bronze and Contour Duo, phenomenal. Been using it every day. That just reminded me, did you guys do baton? Mine was blue. It was a kind of a sparkly blue with the white ends, no tassels. And I never was a real good, I never could do this. I was this kind of baton girl. That just reminded me of that, but I was fascinated with it. Okay, so here they are, the three colors that I ended up keeping. 
I think, I don't even think I've returned the other one yet, so I might have to try it too. This is very, very gray. Unless you are a serious contour connoisseur, I think this is gonna be too gray. And that is the Fair. This, I think this was too dark. Light, medium, yeah. And to the tone is hard to work with, but this one, medium, is the one I've got on today and the one I've been working with all week. Okay, I would say this medium is the most like the Dior Contour Stick or the Too Faced, but these are fun. These are fun. I have really, really enjoyed those this week. Okay, I grabbed this yesterday when I was in Sephora. I was talking to one of the managers there about the best skincare, most popular, this, that, and she was saying how the Sephora line does really well, and she said these eye patches, she used them, and she said she could really tell that they firmed. She said when she took them off, she could feel how much they firmed. Smooth booster mask one pair 97 percent ingredients from natural origin and it says that it smooths fine lines so i am going to try it and let you know okay i've got one more thing new thing let me go on with some more favorites i was so upset that the Too faced laminate brow gel was gone and so i tried several different things and i've come back to this anastasia and Oh my gosh, I love it. It's just so plain. It's beautifully plain Jane. It is just a clear brow gel. You don't have to turn the brush any certain way. It's not going to get on your skin. It doesn't leave crusties. It is just perfect. Perfect. And upcoming, I did an Ulta collaboration that's going to be coming up soon with the Black Friday deals. And they have it where every day is a new deal. And one of those days, Anastasia brow stuff is going to be, gosh, some of it's up to 30% off. Um, I know Estee Lauder is going to be, I think the whole brand is going to be 20 or 30% off. There's going to be really good deals that week. And then this mascara, I have really, really enjoyed. This is the Charlotte Tilbury Exaggerize. And you'll be able to see why. Look how goopy that is. Just goopy goodness. And I love that because I'm just not into just doing a bunch, like spending a lot of time on my brows. Okay, this is something new I'm trying. I've got several new brow products that I ordered, and I ordered two of these, which is the Tom Ford Brow. Didn't even realize it came with an entire refill. And the, of course, the brush on the end, which why would anybody make a brow pencil with no brush on the end, but they do. And then it is the kind that I like that has the you know tip like that. And this is the taupe that I used today. And I have this slight feeling like it might be a little too dark. Let me know. I did get the blonde also, but Brooke said that she liked them. So I used this today for the first time because I want to use some of the products and then be able to tell you about them. And then another favorite that I've gone back to this week is this eye palette. This is... This is dreamy. This is for the sculpted, nude looking, yet not dramatic. The look that I like. I like nude colors, but I like looking daytime bombshell. And that's what this does. It's just beautiful. The colors are just beautiful and they're matte. And it's called the Sophisticate. I've told you guys about that before. And then I only grabbed one of these, but they're so cute. I took pictures that I'll put in here. Benefit has this new little collection and it's little, different little thing. I remember the first one I saw was sardines. And in each thing, it has different products. And I was so tempted to get all of them, but they were kind of redundant. Like other ones would have the mascara. The reason I got this is because that is one of my all-time, all-time favorite mascaras. And on top of that, I like this small one better than the full size. One of my all-time, all-time favorite bronzers, Hula. I like the small one. I just do. And then the tint is great for staining your lips. If you just want that, um, it's, it's more than my lips, but better. It's kind of like a child. You know, a child has so much color to their lips. So this is called Looking Super. And I just thought it was pretty cool. Okay. Then Dean Davidson sent me a little special holiday gift. Is that not the 
cutest, prettiest little like travel case, I guess it would be. It reminds me of, don't even ask me what made me think about this, but it kind of reminds me of like Priscilla Presley, I guess the velvet and the glamorous, the pretty colors, that Elvis movie, or no, it was actually the Priscilla thing. That's what it reminded me of. And then he sent me some of his hoops. I just got this yesterday, so I have not worn these, but look, I'm pretty excited about these with the little black onyx bead. And I like how they're small. Oh, wow. I'm still just like over the moon over my ideal diamonds. That, that last set, first of all, it's the Tamara Kalinic collection. They're fabulous, but they're easier to put on because the back part doesn't have all those three different holes. I've been taking those off and putting those back on almost every morning. And then there's this little hoop that is a little bit bigger. And then, gosh, I should have brought a drink out here. I'm running out of voice. I've gotten so excited. I've got these on that are Ana Luisa. And I am collaborating with them over on Instagram. I had heard of them many, many times. And Brooke has gotten some stuff, my daughter, from them before. So they asked me. And so I ordered a few things and I have been very impressed. I actually placed another order and it's supposed to be here any day. So just, I'll, sh I'll either be wearing it or show you. But one thing is this mood ring, which I don't know if you guys are like me. I loved a mood ring when I was little. There was something fascinating about a mood ring. My aunt Beverly wore a big mood ring. Like I loved these. I loved like, even when they were in like the good old fashioned, prize gumball machines. I always wish I was going to get one. So that's something else from Ana Luisa. And then I've got this on now. This, it's the Zodiac necklace. And of course, mine is Virgo, but look at how much that little bitty necklace shows. I love it. And it's stationary. It doesn't move all around. I think their stuff has, this is not sponsored, but I think their stuff has like a two-year guarantee, free returns, and it's humidity-proof, tarnish-proof. It's supposed to be really, really durable things, and they're running a Black Friday special, like most people are, and so I will link these below. And it's going on now because today is Wednesday, but it starts tomorrow. And you know what? I'm really worried about this on my hand. Let me wipe this off and I'll be right back and I'm gonna show you just two more things. Okay, a couple of things I wanted to show you from Walmart. This is just like the black one, but I had to order, does it have the tag on it? I haven't worn it yet. Maybe I already took off the tag. Okay, this is just like the black one, but the leopard. This is such a good little jacket. Oh my gosh. Okay. I love it. I love it. I love it. I hope it's still available. I haven't even looked, but so soft. It has that chevron, you know, channeling. So I wanted to show you that. And then I think I bought this last year and I gave it to, I think I gave it to my mom, but it is this little joy spun it's like a little house jacket, but look at that. It might be my, yeah, this is going to be my daytime. <laughs> Don't tell anyone. Yeah, this is what I'm going to wear today. I already know because I'm going to get my hair done. So I want snuggly stuff and comfortable stuff. And this comes in many colors. It doesn't zip up or anything. And, but it feels just amazing. I love when something I wear around the house has a band. That's why I always love those Mason, Mason something robes. Remember, I like the banded sleeves because when you're washing your face or brushing your teeth, I don't want stuff like coming down. And oh my gosh, I'm not taking this off. It's so snugly. So, okay, you guys, I could keep on showing you a few more things, but I feel like we... We must end it here for today. I've got, I've been making so many videos for upcoming Black Friday deals. Walmart is having some serious Black Friday deals on their televisions. John might get a new one for, I don't know if it's for out here or for our bedroom. Really good deals on, of course, like wrapping paper and things like that. And then um, I got a new light that I will show you that's going to be um, on their Black Friday deals for our, I always like that big light that just shines up on the house. 
and just lots of good stuff. So make sure you follow me on Instagram because a lot of the stuff I just do on Instagram most of the time. I If I really love something, I'm going to usually tell you guys about it too. Um, candles. I've got some candles over here that are going to be on their Black Friday. So I will see you very, very soon. I think the next video I'm going to do is quince because I've got so much, another pair of boots and so much other good stuff to show you. So thank you guys so much for being here. Thank you to Comfeely for sponsoring a portion of this video. Honestly, a big, a big thrill and so much good stuff. And this and the boots, I could go on and on. So thank you for being here with me and have a good night and I will see you real soon. Bye-bye.